you. Um, we're going to have two moves that we pair together, each move for 30 seconds. And we're going to do those two moves through four times each. Remember, it's rest-based training. So you push until you can't go anymore. And then you rest until you're ready to go again. So resting is not bad. Pacing is what we're not wanting to do. So um, the goal is to do your personal best, right? No guilt, no shame, no condemnation. Your personal best. Our scripture for today is from Psalms 138.8. And it's one of my favorites. The Lord will fulfill his purpose for me. Your steadfast love, O Lord, endures forever. Do not forsake the work of your hands. So we'll be talking about that. That's our intention. I want you to think about that as we're moving together today. Um, you're going to need one set of hand weights and maybe some water, and that's it. And we're just going to jump right in and go for it. So I'm going to grab my weights, get some music going here. I forgot to do that. Let's see. It's a snow day, so my kids are home. They're um, watching TV right beside us, so we'll probably hear from them. I'm afraid. <laughs> um, and we'll get some music going. Let's see here. Maybe. Playlist. I'll just do this. All right. Okay. And my timer. Timer. All right. So our first move is a curl with an overhead press for 30 seconds. So grab your weights and get right in. So I'm going to curl, overhead press. To add more challenge, you can extend a leg behind. You can raise it in front. You can extend in front to engage the core and work on balance. But it's curl, press. TVA is engaged, so pull in your core. You've got five, four, three, two, one. Drop your weights. This is a squat jump and reach. So there's two ways we're going to do it. So this is standard squat jump. So here's a squat and reach. So my arms are straight down, straight up. It's okay, I'm not sure. You've got 15 seconds. You're watching your knees to make sure they don't go in front of your toes. If this is too much, just do squats, standard squats. Okay, five seconds. Four, three, two, one, back to the bicep curl, overhead press. So you've done it one time through. We're gonna do four total. Trying to use the muscle to make the movement, not momentum. 15 seconds. The Lord will fulfill his purpose for me. Eight seconds. Five, four, three, two, drop them. Squat, jump, and reach. My ceiling's kind of low in here. And I'm tall, so not jumping real far. Or you could take your arms here. 15. At any time, you need to stop and rest. No guilt, no shame. Rest and jump back in. Five, four, three, two, three. One, back to curl and press. You're doing great. Third time. By now, your muscles should be getting a little bit fatigued. You may have to rest. You may need to drop your weights. I can hear my kids fighting next door. Can y'all hear it? 10 seconds. Yes, you can. Come on. Five, four, three, two. One, squat jump with a reach. Good job. The Lord will fulfill his purpose for me. Your steadfast love, O oh Lord, endures forever. Do not forsake the work of your hands. Three, two, one, grab your weights. Last time with this move. So proud of you. The beginning's hard, but you're doing it. Yes, you can. So God's work in us is what brings the purpose that we're talking about. 
Lord will fulfill his purpose. His work in us gives us our purpose. Five, four, three, two, one. Drop them. So our purpose doesn't come from our occupation or our marital status or whether or not we have kids or our income level or our fitness level. It's not our behavior or our accomplishments, not our stuff, not a number on the scale or in your clothing. Three, two, one. Next set, set number two. First move, front raise, side raise. These are challenging. If it's too much, drop your weights. You can tell you, these are already hard. Ah, I should have had a lighter set of weights with me to do these with. We've got 15s right now, which is a bit much. Five, four, three, two. I'm gonna drop that. Now you're doing half burpees. So it's just the lower half. So it looks like this. So just continue that. If that's too much, walk your feet. So it look like this. You can, let's add a stand. How about it? Let's add a stand. Five, four, three, two, one. Good job, pick up your weights. Pick up your raise. Front raise, side raise. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. So God's work in us gives us our purpose. He will perfect that which concerns me. He will. He will. I love what Revelation 1 is. They say, if he said it, he will do it. Okay. Drop them, half burpees. So God is stronger than whatever is holding you back. Out of stand. If you need to walk your feet, it looks like this. Walk, walk. You can stand, however you wanna do it. Five seconds. Good job, y'all, come on. Three, two, one, front raise, side raise. Front raise, side raise. If it's too much, take one way. Front raise. Side raise. Front raise. Side raise. 12 seconds. Good job. Good job. Five, four, three, two, one. Drop your way. Half burpees. Come on. Yes, you can. So God is stronger than whatever is holding you back. Do you believe that today? Do you? He will fulfill his purposes for me. Five, four, three, two, one. I believe this is our fourth time through. So you're almost done. Almost done with this one. So I'm doing it right. Doing a front, left, 15 seconds. You're doing great. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Listen to your body. Do your personal best. 10. We've got three, two, one. Last time with these burpees. Last time. Yes, you can. So when our bodies are moving, sometimes our minds are more still. So what's God saying to you right now? In this moment, what is he wanting to work out in your heart? Five, four, three, two, one. Good job. Third set. Grab your weights. Grab them. Sorry, mommy. Bend over row. Sorry. Tricep kickback. Then we'll kick him back. Woo.
Doing great. Keep your back flat. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Drop your weights. I want you to follow me closely here. There's some jumping lunges with a drop squat. It looks like this. Right lunge, left lunge, squat together. If that's too much, reverse lunge. Reverse lunge, squat. But if you can, and keep good form, let's jump. Five, four, three, two, one. Back to a bend over row. Bend over row, tricep kick back. If your weights are too heavy, you can drop them. By the second set, or definitely by the third, if you're using heavy enough weights, you should be needing to rest. 12 seconds. Backs are flat, head is in alignment. Five, four, three, two, one. Lunge, lunge, drop squat. Lunge, lunge. Watching our form, knees behind our toes. If at any point you're experiencing knee pain, I want you to stop and modify. 13. Good job. Proud of you. Come on. Come on. Seven. Five, four, three, two, one. Wait. Woo! I know it's hard. We're getting a lot done. In 20 minutes, you're getting a total body workout. It's going to peak fat burning for 48 hours. Come on. Your personal best. How can we glorify God in this moment? Eight, six, Five, four, three, two, one. Lunge, lunge, squat. Woo! Crowdy, you come on. I know you want to quit. I know you can. I know you can keep going. The Lord will fulfill His purpose for me. He will perfect that which concerns you. He will. Come on. Pick up your weight. I'm not sure how many times that is, to be honest with you. I think this is the third time. But I'm not positive. Rest when you need. 12 seconds. Proud of you. Five. Four, three, two, drop them. Lunge, lunge, squat. Good job. Good job. Halfway here. Squat. Lower intensity if you need to. Five, four, three, two, one. I think this is the last time through. If not, you're doing an extra and that's okay. I think this is our fourth time. Whew. You're over halfway done with the workout. You're over halfway done. Okay. Proud of you. Five, four, three, two, one. Lunge on a squat. Last time with these. Yes, you can. Come on. If you're not in this thing alone, let's do it. Come on. Fifteen. Thirteen. Ten. Five, four, three, two, one. Next move is a plank with a hip drop. I'm gonna try to scoot back where you can see me. I hope you can see me fit over here. So I'm gonna half plank and drop the hip. Core is engaged. Good job.
Can't see my timer. So just keep going. I think you're at three, two, one. Next move, honeys. Cardio move, we're gonna pick a heart rate. When you're ready, start. Go 20 seconds. 15. Proud of you. Come on. You are best. Five, four, three, two, one. Plank, hip drop. You can do a low plank on your elbows if you'd rather. Hold your breath. Drop your hips. I hope you can see me. You're doing great. My timer says eight, seven, six, three, two, one. Guess what? High knees, time number two. Ready when you are? Go. Come on. Yes, he will perfect that which concerns me. He will. If he said it, he will do it. Five, four, three, two, one. Back to hip drops. I'm going back to a low plank. Preferably you have a mat because this hurts elbows if not. Proud of you. Put your breath if you need. Jump back in. Your personal best. You've got 10 seconds. 10 seconds. Come on. Honey, it's time number three. Going great. Honey, when you're ready. working to perfect that which he has begun. And it's not the way we look, it's the work he's doing in our hearts, in our lives, in our obedience, in our submission. Good job, back to plank. Last time, last time. Last time, core tight, core tight. Your body should be a straight line and then you drop hips. Come on. I believe in you. Let's go. Let's go. Push. Ugh. Come on. Fight for it. Good job. Good job. Good job. Honeys, last time. Honeys. When you're ready, honeys, last time. Ready. Set. Come on. God's work in us gives our purpose. Not the work we scurry around trying to do. Mac, shut that door for me. Five, four, three, two, one. That door right there. Okay, last moves. Push-ups, bicycle crunches. These are traveling push-ups. So I'm push-up form, I'm gonna move. I'm gonna push up. I'm gonna move. If you need to do these on your knees, perfectly fine. You move. You've got five, four, three, two, one. Bicycle crunches. So one leg is bent, one is straight, and I rotate to the bent one. I rotate towards it. See? Making sure you're breathing. I'm twisting towards my bent knee. You're halfway there. 15 seconds. Doing great. Yes, you can. 10 seconds. Come on. Five, four, three, two, one. Push ups. Push ups. So I'm going to push up and I travel. You're doing great. You need to go to knees. Go to knees. Rotate feet up so your kneecaps don't hurt. 12. Doing so good. Come on. 
You're doing great. Five, four, three, two, one. Bicycle crunches, second time. This floor is really hard. Oh, hopefully y'all are on a nice mat. You're on carpet. You're on a softer floor. Woo! Doing great. Doing great. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Traveling push-ups. Traveling push-ups. Walk it. Core is tight. Core is tight. You're at 12 seconds. Third time through. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. I'm gonna put my coat down for my back. This floor is sharp. Bicycle crunches. If that's too much, you could go to your elbows and just do the movement with your legs. You've got 12 seconds. 12 seconds. Good job. Five, four, three, two, one. Last time with these push ups. You're almost done, y'all. Almost done. He will fulfill his purpose for me. Do you believe it? Do you? 10, five, four, three, two, one. Last time with these. Last time, bicycle crunches. Trying to get this right here. It's better with healthy coat. 15 seconds. Good job. You've got eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's come back to our feet. Let's finish with 30 seconds on our feet. So we're standing. Squat hold. So proud of you. So proud of you. God's work in us gives us purpose. Not our work. His work in us. We let him. We let him. We say, okay, God, whatever. Whatever you want. Five, four, three, two, one. Good job. So, so proud of you. Good job. Now go stretch. Go pray. Make it a great day.